standard form and comparison of rational number. In the previous video, we have understood what rational numbers are. Now, we will have a look at how to write them in standard form and how to compare them. Expressing rational number in standard form. Imagining a 15 over 20 cup of sugar is going to be more difficult than imagining a 3 over 4 cup of sugar. Yet, they have the same value. Calculating with a fairly large number is also quite complicated. Nearly everyone has trouble making sense of big numbers and negative fractions. That's why we need to convert it into standard form. The standard form of rational number helps us to determine the value of fraction. Every fraction can be written in its simplest form by dividing the numerator and denominator by their greatest common divisor. The same can be done for rational numbers. A rational number, when expressed in terms of a fraction, that is fully simplified, with a positive denominator, is said to be in standard form. For example, let's consider the fraction minus 2 over 3. Here, the numerator and the denominator exist in the simplest form and have no other common divisor except 1. Furthermore, the denominator is also positive. Therefore, two conditions are satisfied, and hence, minus 2 over 3 is the standard form of this rational number. Now, let's move on to the final step, where it is you who will be tested. Which of the following rational numbers below are in standard form? 2 over minus 3, 20 over 5, 48 over 12, 1 over 2. Comment your answers to find out how you have performed. Comparing rational numbers. When you have two rational numbers in front of you, how will you find out which one is greater and which one is smaller? If the denominator has the same numbers, we can easily compare both numbers. But in this case, we will compare rational numbers with different denominators. So, to tackle such questions, you have to follow three simple steps. First, rewrite the given rational numbers so that their denominators are positive. Since the denominator is already positive, we don't need to make any changes. But when you get a negative denominator, change it to positive. It has the same value. Second, express the rational number with a common denominator. To express both with the common denominator, we will have to multiply two unlike fractions with unlike fractions made from both denominators of the given rational numbers. So we end up with the same bottom. Now, both fractions have the same denominators. Last but not least, compare both fractions to get to know which one is bigger. So, 5 over 7 is greater than 2 over 5. Now the ball is in your court. You have to find out which of the following rational numbers is greater. 2 over minus 3 and 4 over 5. 2 over 10 and 1 over 6. 3 over 9 and 4 over 10. Apply the three steps one by one. Doing these questions by applying the three steps will enhance your grip on the concept and its application. Find the answers in the description of the video.